Hey everybody, it's Spoon here. I'm gonna <clears throat> talk about checking out, let's see if they're powered or not, and a couple of ways that I do it. Um, so this outlet is supposed to be powered. Now, you can use one of these chicken chair. They call it, some people call them chicken sticks, some people call them tick tracers. I learned them as tick tracers coming up. It's not showing that it's hot. And then this, it's called a plug bug. I call it a plug bug. The real name, I have no idea. This one's an ideal. Plug it in, and it's showing hot. Chicken stick didn't do it. Either I did something wrong with the chicken stick, or he's got this one set up as a... No, chicken stick's not working right. That's the bad thing about these. You can never tell if they're working right or wrong. So I plug the plug bug in. And I can check. And with the, these two lights lit, that means it's wired correctly. So I know it's wired correctly. Um, and if I was going to go down, when I once eventually go down to check the breakers, um, when I tur kill breakers, this is what it'll tell me if I uh, have turned it off or not. And you know like how people plug in lamps or other tools, which works. <laughs> that works. It's a light indicator. This is easier on me because I can carry this in my tool bag. And then I use this... Um, analog tester a lot more than I do digitals for when I'm doing this type of work because I'm not necessarily chasing down exact voltages what I'm doing is to see if something's hot and when I came up through an apprenticeship this is what we use so yeah it's reading 120 um, so on this, I can get it. So on this, you see the scale here? You're never going to get an exact number, and that light will come up when you have, when it's a hot circuit too, to let you know. Um, and it works off a spring system, so the spring will move, and it uh, works off a magnetic field. And do I know exactly how this thing works? Yeah, I was taught years ago. Um, I forgot. I forgot all the particulars to it. I just know that it works. I know the basics on how it works. So this is telling me I got 120 on that circuit. That's what I want. Um, plug bugs telling me it's wired correctly. So I don't have to go back in and change anything. Um, chicken stick sucked. Batteries may be dead. Anything could be going on with it. Um, I got others. This was a cheapie. I bought some place because I really don't use them. I don't particularly care for them. Uh, I use my analog tester. I used to have a Wiggins, a Wiggy, and I went to the Ideal because my Wiggy got tore up. And the Ideal has been good for me for years. Um, yeah, so that's how I do a basic check when I'm checking uh, receptacles to see if they're hot. Spoon out.